King Charles and Queen Camilla's coronation may be over, but there's one moment from the ceremony that caught people's attention. Onlookers are convinced they spotted the Grim Reaper at Westminster Abbey as guests started arriving to the historic event. In the video, a hooded figure in all black can be seen walking across the aisle holding a long stick. The quick moment had royal fans talking on Twitter with one user writing, anyone else just noticed the Grim Reaper at Westminster Abbey? With another tweeting, why is the Grim Reaper at the coronation celebrations? Despite a possible sighting from the Angel of Death himself, King Charles's coronation went off without a hitch. The 74-year-old royal's coronation marked the first since Queen Elizabeth's in 1953 and comes almost eight months after he ascended the throne following her death. King Charles became the 40th monarch to be crowned at Westminster Abbey in a tradition dating back to 1066. His wife, Camilla, was also crowned on Saturday. She was previously known as the Queen Consort and will now officially be referred to as Queen Camilla. Access Hollywood recently chatted with DailyMail.com's Charlie Langston and she explained about the royal family's ensembles for the coronation and what they mean. I don't think for a second that King Charles sat Kate down and said, you know what, I don't think you should wear that dress because you're going to look too good. I don't think you should wear that tiara because you're really going to outsparkle me on my big day. That's just not who Charles is. However, in his role as king, Charles has very much prioritized a slimmed down image of the monarchy. He wants to really undo that kind of vision that a lot of people have of the monarchy being very showy with their wealth, of being all about big jewels and shiny tiaras. And he wants to prioritize the charitable works that the royal family does, the work that they do in terms of enriching the lives of the British public. And so in that same vein, he doesn't want the coronation to be a massive, ostentatious show of wealth. So a lot of consideration has been taken when it comes to what tiaras the female royals will wear, what outfits they might wear. Because if Kate steps out in a dress that costs $10,000 with a priceless tiara that's you know covered in rubies, it's not going to align with the message that Charles is trying to send as king. So co consideration will be taken as far as Kate's outfit is concerned, as far as Camilla's outfit is concerned, but by no means was Charles sitting across from his wife and his daughter-in-law telling them that they couldn't look too good because he was worried that they would overshadow him.